This is lesson 9.2, Translations. Your objectives are to draw translations and to draw translations on the coordinate plane. A translation is a slide. It's when you take a point or a figure and you slide it to another position. You don't turn it, you don't flip it, it is just a slide. Graph each figure and its image along the given vector. Number three, graph the quadrilateral with vertices that are given, and we will move it along the vector that goes negative two and negative four. Remember when a vector is written in component form like this, the first number tells you how far left or right, and the second number tells you how far up or down. So each point in this quadrilateral will be translated to negative two, which would be two to the left, and negative four, which would be four down. So let's do that. T is negative one, one. U is 4, 2. W is 1, 5. X is negative 1, 3. And now each point will go negative 2, which is 2 to the left, and negative 4, which is 4 down. T goes two to the left, four down. To T prime. X goes two to the left, four down. To X prime. W, two to the left, four down. It ends up at point T so it doesn't get a new name. U goes two to the left, four down. To U prime. And now we have the new quadrilateral. It wasn't rotated, it wasn't flipped, it just simply translates each point goes two to the left, four down, which sends it down in that direction. Pentagon D, E, F, G, H will be translated using the vector in component form negative 1, 5. So this will go 1 to the left and 5 up. The original point D is negative 1, negative 2. E is 2, negative 1. G is 4, negative 4. H is 1, negative 4. I is negative 1, 5. I got a little bit off track on that one, didn't I? This is not point I. That is the component form of the vector. I skipped point F, which is 5, negative 2. So let's put that in. 5, negative 2. There's point F. Okay, now we got it. I jumped the gun there. So let's draw the pentagon. Now, each point will go one to the left and five up. Point D, one to the left, five up, right there. D prime. E, one to the left, five up. E prime. F, one to the left, Five up. At F prime. G, one to the left, five up. For G prime, 
H, one to the left, five up. For H prime, and now I will connect the dots. When I have a pentagon that was translated the pre image to its image using component form of a vector. One to the left, five up. Translations do not flip, they do not rotate, they simply slide. Find the translation that moves the figure on the coordinate plane. From figure 1 to figure 2. Well, figure 1 to figure 2 goes to there. To find out the translation, we need to see which direction and how far each point goes. So let's pick a point on shape number 1 and move it to its corresponding point on shape number two. Consider the bottom right point on shape number one. We're moving to shape number two. So let's match it to the bottom right point on shape two. We go left or right first, and then we go up or down. To get from one to two, we're going four to the right and then we go two up. So component form of that will be four, two. Four is left or right. It's positive, so it's right. Two is up or down. It's positive, so it's up. Four to the right, two up. From figure two to figure three. Same job, let's do it from figure two to figure three. Pick a point on two and move it to the corresponding point on three. It doesn't matter which point you choose, I could choose the bottom left point and match it to the bottom left point of figure three. Go left or right first, so I go four to the left, that will be a negative four, and then I go up one, that will be a positive one. Notice these are angle brackets for the vector component form. Negative four means move four to the left. Positive one means go up one. Each point goes four to the left, one up. 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 Four to the left, one up.